Yat e Asnena a. Good evening. Shae Lucy Tabahats of the Shishne, Twodig Ocean Schledo, Twodig Eat in Bashishin, Desh Cheat in the Shiche, Dokin Le Cheat in the Shanala, not Ani Nes and Yusinasha. I serve on the Grants Committee for the New Mexico Riders Association. We establish the grants to honor and encourage aspiring New Mexico riders, especially those who may not have access to support that is available to riders in academia or, or published riders. We aim to ensure that the grant recipients reflect the diversity, the beautiful cultures, and the geographic areas of our state. We are the only organization of this type. In our four year existence, we have awarded 30,000 in grants to 14 riders in New Mexico. Many of the recipients have gone on to publish children's books, books of poetry, or have completed manuscripts in various genres. Congratulations to this year's grantees. We're so proud that you have chosen us to share in your writing journey. Thank you. My name is Renata Golden and I'm a creative nonfiction writer in Santa Fe. I'm currently working on an essay collection about the Chiricahua Mountains in Southeastern Arizona, the ancestral home of the Chiricahua Apaches. Being awarded the Douglas Preston Travel Grant enabled me to go back to the Chiricahuas to do some research and some fact checking. So thank you, Douglas Preston and the New Mexico Writers. Hi, I'm Zach Hively. I live near Abiquiu, New Mexico, where I am right here. I am a writer of poetry, creative nonfiction, and humorous essays. I was able to use the New Mexico Writers Grant in 2021 to work on assembling, uh, revising, and compiling a project I have called Honky Rhinestone and His Cowboy which, pending everything, should be released in 2023 from Casa Uraca Press. Thank you, New Mexico writers, for the support. Hi, my name is Jean Lee Gassman. I go by Jean or Jeannie. I have no preference. I live in Rio Doso, New Mexico. I write fiction, creative nonfiction, and a little bit of poetry. My first novel, Blood of a Stone, was published by a small press in 2015. I've just finished revisions on my second novel, The Double Sun, a story about a family of downwinders. My grant paid for me to attend a week-long novel writing workshop with Vermont College of Fine Arts, two workshops with agents on writing query letters, and an ongoing workshop on the craft of fiction. Thank you very much. Hi, my name is Jason A. Snap, and I live in Albuquerque, New Mexico. I am a uh, filmmaker, a screenwriter, um, and an indigenous film critic. Uh, for <coughs> the New Mexico Writers Grant, uh, I um, wrote a uh, piece on three indigenous female filmmakers here in New Mexico for New Mexico Magazine. Um, I'm greatly appreciative for the grant. Uh, it helped me write that piece in addition to work to, uh, to the work on my screenplay, feature-length screenplay that I'm working on called The Councilman. So thank you again, New Mexico writers. My name is Denise Chavez, and I am one of the directors of Libros para el Viaje, Books for the Journey. It's an ongoing book distribution program for refugees and migrants. I'm here with Carrie Lenander at this wonderful mother house, El Rinconcito del Libro. Carrie, thank you for all of your work. We've worked for several years now distributing over 35,000 books. And we want to thank the New Mexico writers for the donation uh, that allowed us to do an anthology called We Are Here to Represent. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's Chelsea Bunn. I'm from New York, but I relocated to New Mexico a few years ago, and now I live and teach in Albuquerque. I write poetry, and my first chapbook was published in 2019. And I've used this grant from New Mexico writers to subsidize my living expenses as I continue to work on my full-length collection. And it's also helped in part to fund submission fees as I send my new work out. And beyond the 
financial assistance. Um, it's also given me a great deal of encouragement and support as I continue to work on my Morning. new book. My name is Khadija Van Brekel, and I'm a contemporary young adult author who writes stories for teens who, like my three daughters, are both Black and Muslim, who rarely see themselves in books. I would like to thank the New Mexico Writers for their generous grant in 2020. Because of the pandemic, I had to shift the use of my grant, but I was able to attend many online conferences, and I actually joined the Authors Guild, a professional writers organization. I live in Albuquerque, and it's nice to meet you. Hi, my name is Emily Withnall. I live in Santa Fe. I was born in Taos and grew up in Las Vegas, New Mexico, and I also lived for eight years in Missoula, Montana. I write primarily nonfiction, including memoir, essays, and journalism. I've been published in places like Gay Magazine, Tin House, Kenyan Review, Ms. Magazine, High Country News, Progressive Magazine, and others. And I'm also a regular contributor to El Palacio Magazine here in Santa Fe. I write about a lot of personal issues, including being a queer single parent and economic justice issues. I'm an economic justice writing fellow with Community Change. And I also write about the environment and blend environmental themes with personal themes in a lot of my writing, including the book that I am currently working on called Fracture, which is about my experience with domestic violence and hydraulic fracturing. And New Mexico Writers Grant is helping me finish that, so thank you. Hi, fellow storytellers. I'm so happy to be here tonight. My name is Laurel Goodluck. I also go by Lori. I live here in Albuquerque, New Mexico, but I'm also a tribal citizen of the Mandan, Harats, and Arikara Nation and the Simshian Nation. And I am a children's book writer. I write picture books and I have my debut picture book coming out this September and it's called Forever Cousins. And I have six more books to follow that I'm really proud of. And I also have a couple of friends here tonight who won the award, so I'd like to celebrate them, but also thank New Mexico writers for believing in me back in 2019 when they awarded me the grant. I was able to go to the Quelly Conference in New York City. I was able to really learn more about the craft and meet a great community. It just opened up my world. So thank you, New Mexico writers.